Welcome to Allegedly Tarot. <laughs> Hi everyone, I'm going to use the Tarot Illuminati deck tonight, and this is from uh, Low Scarabale, and I like this deck when I'm talking about the elite or the royals. I have lots of decks I use, but I just use the one that I um, feel like using at the time or uh, call me. To, so. This reading is going to be about um, Harry and if he can forgive his family because it's not about that if they done wrong. It's, as you probably know yourself, um, if you feel like somebody has done wrong to you, um, and you hold a grudge, it eats you up more than it does the person that did it. So, as I say, you know, forgiveness doesn't guarantee the end of the pain, but it helps you to move on. And I have learned this in my life. <laughs> and somebody might not even know that they've even done anything, you know, or... The thing that they have supposedly done, <laughs> it depends on your mental attitude at the at that moment, and <clears throat> it's oh anyway I'm not even <laughs> let's just say Harry, please try to forgive your family, <laughs> and <clears throat> what I would like to do is um, see if we can help him <laughs> help him to forgive. So, Harry, if you're watching, <laughs> this is for you. For entertainment purposes only, of course. Okay. Um, so, I'm just going to cut these cards. I feel like they've been shuffled enough. Cut these. And, oh, I'm like, Turn them upside down. There you go. And one more time. Or a couple. <laughs> okay, yeah, I'm done. Okay. Now, what I would like to do is ask Harry, is holding on to anger causing you pain? So we're going to deal the cards like this. This is going to be it's one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. Harry, we're going to ask you some questions here. <laughs> is holding on to the anger causing you pain? Oh, yes. I would say so. The hanged man. I feel like he feels like he's been sacrificed, um, done hard done by, you know. Uh, he's not even looking at it from a different light. I know this is upright, but this is what he needs to do. Harry, you need to look at it differently. <laughs> That's what the cards are telling you, the hanged man look at it differently because this is, um, it's only eating you up. So Harry, how will the act of forgiveness change you? <laughs> so if you forgive, what is going to happen? The two of pentacles in reverse. Well, you have some choices to make, don't you? And this is this is, oops, let's put it in, yeah, you have one of two roads to go down. You can either go down the right road and not, not take this stormy sea back here, because what are you doing now? Because you're not forgiving, um, 
your life is just one big stormy sea, like a ship on the sea, you're going to crash into the um, rocks. So how will the act of forgiveness change you? And you know that. You will, you yourself know that. <laughs> will forgiveness allow me to move on, Harry? <laughs> the seven of wands. You know, you just keep on thinking over and over again about what everybody has done to you. You're stuck in this. Look at you defending always in defense mode because you can't forgive what you think that uh, people have done to you and your family so um yeah uh the, the will forgiveness help you to move on that that is um that's your problem right there if not if you don't forgive you're going to be constantly stuck in defense mode so, will forgiveness help me create a new future? Look at that, a four of swords. Because if you don't forgive, you're going to be, this is a stress. Harry, you are stressed out because of your family, <laughs> of doing, or your family supposedly, I don't know, allegedly doing you wrong. That is your defense, and look, it's causing you much stress and sickness. Like, yeah, look, there's the underlying, even though it's usually under here, like a secret. <laughs> That's it right there. It's over you like the Sword of Damocles. So, yeah, I, it'll help you move on, but will you, will you listen? So, um, what action should you take, Harry? What action should you take? The Six of Pentacles, that is a, well, number one, it's charity, isn't it? <laughs> and you, yeah, you should, this is a give and take card. You should give as much as you take from people. You need to listen. You need to listen, Harry. <laughs> and what is your lesson? Well, let's see if you learn a lesson. But uh, what is it? Of the Prince of Cups in reverse. <laughs> this is this is your brother. <laughs> your lesson. Look, you have no brother. That's your lesson. Without you forgiving. And and you saw at Christmas time, like somebody else is taking your place. Somebody else is taking your place and being your brother or William's brother because you're not there and you won't forgive and you have no brother because you won't forgive. And I'm not saying, I mean, well, we, we never know what's going on behind the scenes, do we, about the uh, royal family. And, um, but whatever has happened, and I'm not taking up for Harry, but whatever has happened is real in his mind. So this, that's your reading, Harry. So forgive people and you'll have a better life. <laughs> This is for entertainment only, and I hope you enjoyed uh, sitting in on this reading and uh, with Harry. <laughs> and if so, uh, we'll we'll do this again. And um, please hit the like button and the subscribe, and share it to others if you like my content. Thank you. Mm -hmm.